Good afternoon, Foundation staff. This is Dr. Theron Sherman. Today's briefing does not contain any objectionable material. That is, unless you've worked at the Foundation this long having a problem with censorship and thought policing the general populace. Didn't think so. Now, this is a reminder that this briefing is brought to you by the Site42 Broadcast Network, which brings you the best possible news, anomaly briefings, and entertainment content in the Foundationverse. Head to the Site42 beacon in the description to support our mission on Patreon and other social media platforms using your encrypted Foundation-issued accounts. Steve. Let's begin. Item number, SCP-1984-J. Classification level 2, Restricted. Containment class, Keter. Description class, Amida. Risk class, Notice. Special Containment Procedures. George Orwell's estate must be seized at all costs. After this, publication of SCP-1984-J will be halted indefinitely. Copies of SCP-1984-J will be gathered by Mobile Task Force Delta-9184, codename the Over Specifics, whereafter they are to be incinerated. Simultaneously with these efforts, latent C-class amnestics are to be released by air throughout the planet. Once all copies of SCP-1984-J have been destroyed, these amnestics are to be activated, permanently eliminating any memory of SCP-1984-J from human consciousness. Description SCP-1984-J is the novel 1984 by English author George Orwell. SCP-1984-J tells the story of a hypothetical dystopia in which independent thought is criminalized and an unseen character called Big Brother is worshipped as a dictator. Pfft, sounds like a complete narcissist. What's the point of having a shadow government if they have a cute nickname for you? SCP-1984-J compels people who are aware of it to compare any use of control or power to the dystopia portrayed in Orwell's work, no matter how absurd of a comparison this may be. Consult Addendum 1 for more information. While no individual appears entirely immune to this effect, individuals who have actually read SCP-1984-J seem much less susceptible. Addendum 1. The following is an incomplete list of concepts compared to SCP-1984-J by Foundation staff. The use of amnestics to maintain the veil. The SCP Foundation's numerous misinformation campaigns. The containment of humanoid anomalies. Being requested not to defecate in a personal trash can. The termination of a Portuguese tribal community. The implementation of ACS, the anomaly classification system, across the SCP Foundation. Site 4214's dress code policies, specifically the wearing of safety goggles during experiments. Project Whack-A-Mole. The United States government doing anything ever for any reason. The dictionary. Redaction and expungement of non-info hazards or cognito hazards. The existence of gay people. The implementation of stringent countermeasures to control dangerous thought across the non-anomalous world through introduction of alternative facts so as to maintain a safe normalcy. Any political ideology except for neoliberalism. Neoliberalism. Quote, every religion that has ever existed, I swear, end quote. Internet moderation. Oh, wait a minute. We seem to have a new message regarding this document. Let's check it out. From Jamie Van Petrel, Site 4214 researcher, to Gummy Johnson, Site 4214 director. The special containment procedures for SCP 1984 J concern me. As an anomaly, SCP-1984-J poses no real threat to the veil or to humanity. And yet, we are going out of our way to eliminate an iconic work of literature from the public consciousness? This feels wrong. I get SCP-1984-J can be annoying at times, but surely there are better ways of handling it than this. Right now, it just all feels a bit Fahrenheit 451. Hmm. It sounds like Van Petrel is having a Are We the Baddies moment. Go amnesticize and re-educate them before they go all V for Vendetta on us, okay? Alright staff, that ends our broadcast. Use your Foundation Encrypted YouTube account to like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, and support our broadcasts on patreon.com slash site42. Secure. Contain. Protect. Thank you for listening. Site42 Studios and its staff are funded by viewers like you. Please become a patron or visit our merch store at the link in our bio to support our work. Secure. Contain. Protect.